Welcome! The following video will show you how to set up the Bluetooth disarming feature for your 2GIG Edge security system. Note, only the Edge system's master user or 2GIG installation professional can set up the Bluetooth disarming feature for a user. Rather than entering a code to disarm the Edge security system, a user can automatically disarm his or her panel with a smartphone. To set up Bluetooth disarming for one of your system's users, you'll need to pair your user's smartphone to your panel. Once the pairing process is complete, the user can begin enjoying the convenience of Bluetooth disarming. Here's how Bluetooth disarming works. The user will put the panel in armed away mode and then leave the residence. As the user gets further and further away from the residence, his or her phone will eventually lose the Bluetooth connection to the panel due to distance and range. Later on, when the user returns to the residence, his or her phone will be close enough to the panel to regain the Bluetooth connection. Once the user does something to trigger an entry delay sensor, such as opening the front door, the user's paired phone will automatically disarm the panel. To set up Bluetooth disarming, first tap the System Settings icon. You'll then need to enter your master user or installer code. Next, tap Users. You'll see a list of all of your users on screen, locate the desired user, and then tap the pencil icon next to the user's information. The Edit User menu will display and you'll want to locate the Bluetooth disarming section. Tap the right arrow icon within the Bluetooth disarming section. Next, you'll want to tap the Pair button. And then ensure the user's device is set to discoverable mode. Tap the Scan button. And you'll see a message on screen letting you know the panel is looking for nearby Bluetooth devices. And then the panel will display a list of all the Bluetooth devices it detected within range. Locate the user's phone and then tap the right arrow icon next to the phone's name. You'll then see a pairing pop-up message on both the panel and the user's phone. At this point, you'll want to make sure the code shown on the user's phone matches the code you see on the panel. Once you've confirmed the two codes match, tap the Pair Device button on the panel's pop-up message. Then tap the Pair button within the pop-up message on the user's phone. Once the phone is successfully paired to the panel, you'll see a success message. Tap OK to close the message. You'll notice the name of the user's newly paired phone now displays on screen. To return to the home screen, tap the Home icon. Congratulations! The Bluetooth device setup process is now complete, and the user can now enjoy the convenience of touchless system disarming.